Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're in Abu Dhabi for the last round of uh, CCRL. Uh, as you saw, we're just a wild card for the season. We're in the Merc, we set a flying lap. This is actually the best lap we set all weekend. This is now Q3. We don't even get anywhere close to this. Two tenths off in the last Q. That's just terrible. We finished the qualifying P9, which is absolute sass. It couldn't get any worse for could it? Five lights in. And the Abu Dhabi Grand Prix is underway. We actually get a flying start again. I don't know what it is, but we just get amazing starts again. Turning into turn one, there is a spinner. But oh, we've got so lucky to so hit that. As you can see. Oh, there also was a car on our inside being backed out like uh, there were four safety cars in this race. Um, and this is for the main reason you just had cars spinning off to, on the right there, uh, racing point had gone. Um, this is another virtual safety car. There are a lot, so we don't really understand why there are so much. We try so hard to get past man with the cash under the VSC. We just managed to uh, he did get past us there one night later anyway, so it didn't matter too badly. This Red Bull going in so deep, we're going to get an amazing run around the other side. Uh, we actually do pretty well uh, to secure the position to get around the other side. What an amazing move that was. There was a little bit of contact, but that corner day, you have to expect it. Um, one lap later, he gets the DRS. So we've actually got a teammate. Now, I really want to do our, our teammate a massive favour now. Better chance of getting more points than I do, so I've got no pace around this track. We go in so deep just to hold up the end. In fact, backfires, we get a bad exit, our teammate goes through, um, but we also lose a lot of momentum. Thankfully, we have DRS uh, due to that, but our teammate also does, so he's going to go around the outside of the red room. We're going to watch this battle in front as he gets forced off the track, then that could be a penalty because he didn't give the position back like he's supposed to give the position back. Um, so yeah, our teammate tries again, but he had to give up the position. He's actually lagging a little bit. Um, I didn't want to get past him, but because he was lagging, we had no choice. So now we're into um, P5. Uh, this is just not where I want to be. I want my teammate to get the ring and put this as well. We've actually let our teammate go now. Um, yeah, we've now got Vettel right behind us. So I wonder where he's going to. As we get... Oh, we've been rear-ended. Thanks, Vettel. We actually got a lot of damage from that. Thankfully, um, but yeah, I'm just fed up being hit. I mean, I am going slowly, yes, but it's just my tires are And now Senna too! Lags, come on! Like, this is, an, this is a long race, we need to chill out. He didn't get a penalty, but he didn't get a war, um, any uh, damage, sadly. Man with the cash, who we were fighting with earlier, is now out of the race. And this is horrendous things. As you can see here on the left hand side, his car parked up against the barrel. He's had a massive crash, we're not really too sure what went wrong there. I don't know if there was contact or if he did on his own. Uh, moving on for a long way in the future, we get um, a Renault now diving us off the inside. We tried so, so hard not to let him go through, uh, but that doesn't really work, so he gets a better exit. We, uh, we have slipstream, but we have very high wings, so we Oh, we are so slow on the train, the PCC, even more restriction, it's not even close. Uh, neither of us have the other, so I don't know if that's just a glitch in the game. But we are going to go with a little bit of a dive on that, just to make sure it gets close to the apex, so we get a better exit. This has actually worked extremely well for us, so we get DRS on the back train. Uh, we're gonna, I think we're going to go to the outside. Uh, yeah, we do. Right, so we go to the outside. We're going to try our best just to get it around the outside. We've made contact. We actually have got damage from it. Uh, we're gonna, I didn't notice at the time, uh, but we do actually have major damage. I did never said anything about it, but then here you go. Yellow front wing. Like, it doesn't look too bad, but trust me, around this track, that was massive. That way, it's just massive. Like, the car behind us is 4 seconds behind. He's also got 21 seconds worth of time. Which is why I'm showing this clip, because I expect the engineer to actually be able to talk on this. But, uh, for some reason, he's been, uh, he didn't talk, so... We just know he's got 21 seconds penalties, so we, instead, we're going to back to him. Just have a little bit of fun. Just because why not? So we're on the outside of Vettel again. Um, why is he move? No, never mind. Vettel comes back at us. Uh, we're still going side by side, but we finally get the move done. Uh, 
we're just gonna stay on board for the whole set. You just see how slow I really am. It's just, I've got no grip or something compared to all the others. I mean, I am using a uh, controller, but even then, running wide, we're gonna get dive bombed again. We do. Uh, but thankfully, uh, Vettel is just about He comes through his final two corners. He's gonna look to have a dive bomb. He takes so much curves off the track, in fact, he runs out of fuel. Uh, I've uh, looked behind me in the brakes. Uh, so we actually do get P6 here. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.